We come together first and foremost to honor the people we lost on that horrific day. Nearly 3,000 men, women, children in New York, in Arlington, in Shanksville. For their loved ones, the pain from the loss began on 9-11. They felt it every day since. Looking around this department today, we can see how the attacks changed us and changed our diplomacy. Thousands of diplomats served in Afghanistan and Iraq and elsewhere in support of the war against al-Qaeda and other terrorist groups. Thousands more served in new bureaus and roles that didn't exist before the attacks, like counterterrorism, conflict and stabilization. Virtually every part of the department was mobilized in some way to play a role in preventing another 9-11. Critical work that many of us continue to this day. Whether you were part of the team that was there when the, the attacks occurred, whether you joined because of those attacks, or whether you came here for some other reason altogether, what we all have in common is that deep down we feel a calling to try to do right by our fellow Americans, to try to make their lives just a little bit more secure, a little bit more prosperous, a little healthier, with a little more opportunity. And we want to engage the world in a way that makes their lives and our lives and the world better.